Today we're going to do a quick lesson on how to convert bright lacquered brass into an authentic oil rub bronze finish. So the first thing you're going to want to do is check the hardware with a magnet to determine if it's solid brass or brass plated steel. If the magnet sticks, it's brass plated steel and it likely won't hold up to this process. This process works the same whether the hardware is brand new out of the box or old and worn like the doors we're working on here. If your hardware has a lacquer coating on it, you'll need to completely remove it. Lacquer can either be dissolved with solvents or boiled off. Now, boiling lacquer off is a messy process, so we did it outside. Make sure you have enough water to cover all the parts and add a few tablespoons of baking soda to the water to help lift the lacquer. After about 15 minutes in the boiling water, the lacquer will be soft enough to scrape or wipe off. If you're scraping it, Use a sharp piece of wood to avoid scratching the brass. If there is some stubborn lacquer in certain spots, you can remove it with a strong solvent like acetone. If the brass surface is polished, it will probably won't accept the oil rub bronze treatment evenly. You'll get better results if you dull the finish first. You can do this with very fine steel wool or an equivalent nylon sanding pad. Once you have all the surfaces showing an even satin sheen, the pieces are ready for the final cleaning. Be sure to use fresh clean gloves to protect your hands and to keep your finger oils from contaminating the clean brass. Clean the brass thoroughly with the Jax metal degreaser and then rinse thoroughly with water. For the best results, wash the parts again in water with a little Dawn dishwashing liquid in it. Rinse thoroughly and allow to dry. For the oxidation stage, we used Jack's Black Brass and Bronze Darkener. We've also used Surfin Chemicals CB2 Bronze Blackening Solution in the past with very good results. Jack's instructions say that you can either dip the parts or apply the solution with a brush. We found that applying with a brush gives a better result. The brushing action can help even out some trouble spots. When you reach the point where the part has the look you want, immediately rinse it with water and let it dry. If you find the piece has some bare spots or areas that didn't take, carefully scrub off those areas and spot apply more blackening solution, then rinse and dry again. If the whole thing is a disaster, just clean it again and start over. As long as your parts are solid brass, you can repeat until you get it right. Note that this is a living finish, which means it'll wear off over time with use. You can leave the pieces just as they are, or for a little extra protection, you can wax them. Apply the wax liberally with a soft cloth. You can use clear wax or a wax with stain. We used a dark brown wax to shift the color of the final product to a warmer hue. Let the wax dry and then lightly buff it with a cotton cloth. If you don't like the idea of letting the finish rub off naturally over time, then skip the wax step and instead apply several light coats of clear lacquer in a flat or matte finish.